I'm here to tell you, ladies and gentlemen, that productivity starts with one thing, and that's how you attack the day. Let's get into it. Good day, YouTube. My name is Ali, and this is Work vs. Life, a show dedicated to bringing you creative ideas and advice to help you win back your workday and lead a balanced life. If you start your day out without any plan, I can assure you that you're wasting time and you're giving your brain that ability to kind of push back on you and build procrastination. So this is my number one productivity tip for you this week, attack the day. How do we start our day with the right direction, the right mindset and get going so we do not procrastinate and waste time. So you may know by now or you may not that I love to get up in the morning and do my workouts. I train for triathlon, I love it endurance sports. It's just something I really kind of get into. It helps me bring focus to the day and just kind of get my mind right. But what I realize is when I wake up in the morning and I procrastinate for just five minutes, my entire mindset changes. And all of a sudden, all the doubts of the day start popping up early in the morning. So what does that look like? You know, it's kind of rainy outside. Maybe I should shift my workout to the afternoon. I'm not feeling good. I ate a lot of food last night. My stomach is a little upset. So maybe I shouldn't go out and do that run. Or maybe I'm too tired right now and I should just go back to sleep. All these thoughts come rushing in your head at the wrong time. That voice in your head is trying to slow you down. So the key here is to attack the day and just start because your brain is going to give you a million reasons why you shouldn't be doing what you're doing at that moment. So let me give you a couple of tips on how we can go about this. Plan your day out in advance, meaning that before you go to sleep, make sure your bags are packed, your clothes are set up, your water bottle's ready to go. Everything you need in the morning, down to your car keys should already be set up and ready to go. It'll take you 10 minutes to do it at night. It'll take you 30 minutes to do it in the morning. So take care of it at night. Get up and go. Wake up out of bed and move. So how many times have you woken up in the morning, picked up your phone, started scrolling and realized that an hour has passed in your morning? That is not attacking your day. Your job in the morning is to brush your teeth, comb your hair, grab your stuff and leave out the door. So the last tip is set your goal and keep your eye on the prize. Meaning that when you start your day out, you already know that your finish line is at five o'clock in the afternoon and that's where you're trying to get to. Do not wake up in the morning and think about all the things that you have to do that day. You should have planned that out ahead of time. Your smart list is in front of you and you're just attacking your day. Attacking the day is a skill set. It's not something that we're all born with. If you look at the guy next to you and he's getting up at four o'clock in the morning and beating his chest that he's the most productive person in the world, ignore him. Your whole life is based on you doing what's right for you. Get up when you're comfortable, but when you get up, get up and go. You're gonna find that as you're working on your attack the day practice, that there's this evil culprit called distraction that keeps rearing its ugly head. I made a video about it right here. Go ahead and watch it and let me know what you think.